Hey guys, welcome to my channel Code Canvas. In this video, we will see one of the CSS property, border image. So, the border image is a shorthand property that is useful to use an image or a gradient to a border of an element. So, you can use border image property to any element except the internal table elements like td, th, tr when border collapse is collapse. So except these elements you can use border image on any of the elements. Okay. So what will be the syntax? Syntax will be for example we have example tag or example class. Okay. What you can give border image all right with url the path of the image okay with other values the slice image border image slice value and the shape okay so we will see with actual example okay first of all let's create one div with class example okay and let's create css for that with class example, we can give width as 40 view width height, same as width 40 view height. Let's give margin 1em auto to make it align center. Okay. The border, the border is necessary. Okay, 30 pixel for example, solid and let's give it to red or pink. Okay the border value all right let's see how it looks right now you cannot see any element you can see simple border right so let's inspect yeah you can see this simple border all right so now to apply border image you can use border image with URL and in URL you can give this image okay let's see okay you can see this image here all right you can give value as slice value you can give 50 or 30 for example and see how it looks so you can see when you give the slice value border image slice or you can also write down like this border image slice okay and you can give value 35 and it will be fine okay with this you can give border image repeat just like background image you can give border image repeat to repeat or there are few other values also possible so if you use repeat the image will be repeated right let's give it something else initial value also repeat also round if you give round then it will be very nice so you can give it round and see this is how it looks when you give border image repeat so how you use border image it depends on the image right so when you use border or background image, you can give background size, background repeat, just like that. You can use border image, border image slice. Also, you can use border image source here. You can use border image source. It will work fine. And border image repeat around space. It will add some space here between all the images around. You already see stretch. It will stretch the image and unset. It will answer okay so this is a very ba basic example of border image with that you can see uh, we can we can work on another example okay let's uh, let me give color for example pink okay let me comment it out other values border 10 pixel solid pink okay you can keep it the border image here instead of URL 
uh, what you can view. Let me remove this. So you can use border image as repeating linear gradient. Just like linear gradient, you can use repeating linear gradient. Okay, the value will be of uh, 45 pixel not pixel you can give degree 45 degree the color the pink color for example the second value can also pink and one person for example okay the, the third value is let's keep it purple okay uh, in percentage you can give one person okay another value purple and let's keep it 8% and slice value let's keep it 10 okay let me comment out these values if we can keep margin and let's see how it looks so you can see we need width and height okay. now you can see this is the border we have used as a repeating linear gradient so you might notice that we can use linear gradient as background image right so similarly you can use repeating linear gradient as border image the value will be at the 45 degree right you can change the value you can keep it 90 or 0 you can see how it works right yeah you can give 135 degree and the value of pink the color right so this is a very simple example but very useful when you when you want to create such frame for example you can use this border image okay so this is border image and we can add some over effect okay so for over you can apply example over and in over you can simply copy this border image value and just change the value to purple to pink and pink to purple and see what effect it is giving okay let's see let it get reload okay so now let's hover you can see the effect looks like a lighting effect right when you over on the this example class so you can see and let me click here so you can make it over right when you click on over it will show you this border image as over value so yeah let me remove so we can check it yep right so this looks good when you want to create something like a frame a photo frame then you can use this right okay uh, the next example we can use let me just remove this okay. what we can do uh, next we can add let's add border um, let's make it 20 pixel solid and pink okay we have image that we can use all right we can use border image source and url in url you can simply this image okay yeah with that you can use border image size and let's give it value 20 22 okay then let's see how it looks yep it looks something like this but we want to make it look like a square or a shape of hearts okay so with this you can give border image repeat and here you can give it round and see how it looks yep this looks nice isn't it a shape of heart so if you hover 
or if you inspect this element you can see the border image slice 20 22 when you change the value you will realize how it works so this is why the 20 22 value is perfect for this image okay it may be uh, the other value for based on the image okay when you use border image repeat round it is looking like this but if you want to change it to repeat it will be like this a reward space but round that looks perfectly right okay so uh, border image repeat let me just reload and yeah border image repeat round this looks good all right so we gone through few example that how we can use border image css property okay okay guys that's all for this video if you have any question or any suggestions you can leave your comments below or if you like this video please give me a like and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and keep supporting thank you